What's up everyone, Vincent here from Hidden Gems again, this time with the artist Drake and the album Thank Me Later. I know, I know, Drake's not a hidden gem or this album isn't a hidden gem, but I didn't really listen to stuff like this growing up. I listened to more of like new metal and all that stuff, so wanted to take a look at artists back then that are huge now or were huge back then and still huge now um, and re-dive those. So we'll be doing like a Drake dive and any other artists that I believe I missed growing up just because of all the other stuff I was listening to uh, but wanted to dive this one Drake's thank me later so we'll start off with the single over great beat here and rhythm lyrics were good as well saying like my career is gonna last forever and it's never gonna be over and just rolling for as long as he can to keep going and keep pushing forward like he has so far and will probably continue to do so uh, one of the first hidden gems that I liked the most was the resistance uh, clever song and beat from 40 here. I uh, like the story about how he was telling the old him that he needs to let go of the past and move forward, even if it means losing friends or losing any connections to his past. But yeah, once you make it, you want to keep it. So have to make some decisions on that. So great song there for the resistance and a great beat from the producer 40. Uh, love the song as well. Show me a good time. Love the beat from Kanye. Of course, another great beat from Kanye back then still doing what he's doing now but back then of course untouchable at the time and just being able to produce and make amazing beats like he did on this song and just like the lyric and content here from Drake just being like enjoy the fruits of your labor when you get it always look for a good time and always have fun and try and do your best to enjoy life as best as you can so great song there show me a good time another one I liked shut it down uh, love the story here. Just saying that, like, uh, you find the one and then you've got it all. Love the production here from 40 and the way it kept, like, the beat progression here. Uh, this is one of the longer songs in the album. It's about six minutes long, a little bit long over that. And if you've watched any of my videos before, I'm a big proponent to longer songs as long as there's progression. So this song was great, especially from 40. The beat, you can feel the differences, the volume changes, the excitement throughout the song and just the way he kept your attention throughout the six minutes so I really loved shut it down even though again it was six minutes just a nice little journey to go on while you're checking out the song next one I liked was light it up this one had Jay-Z on it so definitely wanted to run that through uh, but a great song here another great beat from 40 and just like the back and forth between Drake and Jay-Z here just like Drake saying like I've made it gonna keep rocking it gonna keep doing it gonna keep going it for as long as I can and keep the flow moving and it's Jay-Z saying like this is stuff to look out for make sure you don't get caught up in it to keep yourself successful and just keep on rolling with it so love the song light it up and the last song on the album I enjoyed was thank me now the last song on the on the album and a great beat here from Timbaland as well and just more of Drake saying just like Thank me for the success I have now. There probably is going to be more to come, which there was. More just more records and more production from him. So overall, really enjoyed the record from top to bottom. But the songs I liked the most were Over for the single, The Resistance for a Hidden Gem, Show Me a Good Time, Shut It Down, Light Up, and Thank Me Now. So in the comments section, feel free to give me any other albums that you really liked growing up or any sort of album that was huge back then around this time frame with this genre. Just didn't listen to these albums like I should have when growing up was listening to other things like I said at the beginning. But comment with any other albums you want to see. As always, like the video, subscribe to the channel so you can see if I got to one of your albums or discussed it further or see if I liked it or not. So as always, like the video, comment with an artist that you want me to take a look at, and subscribe to the channel. Thanks, guys.